Good morning everyone, Brian here from Let's Build Awesome. Today we're going to be doing another Lego haul. These are some small stuff I picked up from, I believe, Walmart, Target, and Toys R Us. So, pretty good deals we have here. I'm really excited. Um, to start off at Toys R Us, I picked up the Juniors Lego Spider-Man vs. Venom set. This is a little spider car chase. I'm very interested to see how these Junior lines do, because um, they're built for juniors yet they come with some cool minifigures so I'm really excited about this set and uh, hopefully it comes out really good um, the the minifigures as I said cool plus it's got the cool printed parts and I just have no idea it's, it's ages 4 to 7 juniors easy to build so I'm probably gonna get a review out on this um, as you can see it is Marvel and I collect all of the Marvel sets so even though it's juniors figured I'd still try it out and see how it is um, and hopefully it's it's a cool set next we have the Sp Ultimate Spider-Man, uh, a spider trike versus Electro. And I was really excited when I saw the set. It was the last one in the store. And I know a lot of people have been having some trouble picking up this set. But it does come with Electro, probably my favorite minifigure from the superheroes lineup, and Spider-Man, of course. Now, as we move on to the second part of this, you, I picked up the Legend Beast Legends of Chima set. I saw these, and I was actually pretty intrigued. Uh, the price... The price point on them is pretty low, and they're only like, I think, $9.99. When I saw this at Toys R Us, it was $12.99, but I went back later, and on a separate shelf, they had them for $9.99. And they were $9.99, so that was a good a good price. Um, it does come with the cool new ball and joint set that everyone's been talking about, and this is just the first one I picked up to try it out and see how good of a small miniature $10 build it is. It comes with a cool minifigure, plus the gorilla, which I thought looked pretty cool, and I just wanted to try it out give you guys a good review. Um, so you'll be seeing quite a few more of these Legends of Chima Legend Beast sets. Um, there are five of them in total, so hopefully I'll pick up all five of them to get some good reviews out for you guys. Alright, I also picked up the Lego Batman uh, vs. Penguin set. Very, very, very cool set. Not really a fan of the Batman. He's still he's a cool minifigure, but I more or less picked this set up for Penguin. It's a cheap way to get Penguin, plus you get his rubber ducky, the two little explosive penguins in the back. I don't necessarily collect the DC superhero sets just because they started producing them way like way back in the day with the original Batman stuff, so it's tough to collect it because some of them are like $1,000, like, bat tumbler and stuff but I also picked up five of the Lego minifigure packs and this was kind of a funny story I looked through the whole store couldn't find any of them and while I was sitting there making my purchase I turned around and there's a video game section behind me and hidden on one of the back corner racks were the Lego minifigure like the box set and I should have picked up more while I was there I'm really like irked that I didn't get all of them because I looked at all stores all around. I went to a different Toys R Us. They weren't there. Um, that was like later on that weekend. So I should have picked a ball. I figured I'd get five now, see which ones I got, go back in later, see which other ones I could get. But I did open all the packs while I was in the car just because I was kind of anxious to see what I got. So we got Western Wiley, uh, Wild Style. Now keep in mind, she was the first one I picked up. The only bag that I actually felt because she had her piece. Um, where's my pants guy? Now these four were just completely blind. I, as I said, I was in mid-order when I turned around the uh, scratching post lady. Uh, Wily Fuse bot with his cool hat, I guess. Um, I wouldn't necessarily pick up this minifigure just other than the fact that he's part of the Lego movie. He's not really that appealing of a minifigure. I don't know if I could use him for anything, um, but still a nice piece to have. And as I said, I was getting ready to pay right as when I turned around and saw these. So I ran, grabbed them, only grabbed five blindly. We also got Lord, uh, Lord Business in his casual business attire. But that's going to wrap up today's video. Make sure you hit subscribe, leave your comments down below, and as always, have a super fantastic day. He doesn't actually sit, he just sort of stands there. So there's the penguin little transportation system. Next you have the cute little little explosive penguins with the detonators on the top that penguin can blow up. So you come with two of those as well as their little ice platform with a light blue gem. 